G. Welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn. I'm coming at you with a little Walgreens testing out a possible glitch. And I'm going to run over to Rite Aid and do an amazing PNG deal. We've got some great things happening at Rite Aid. If you have a Rite Aid, I know not everybody does. But we also have a new PNG Visa remade. I'm so excited. If you are new and you just found the channel, I am so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, I appreciate you. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Uh, EJ's coming over soon, so I had to hurry and go out and do my shopping. And of course, I'm wearing my cool grandma shirt because I'm babysitting in a little bit. I'm so excited to see him. And the girls and I had a great day yesterday shopping and going out to lunch and having a nice, awesome treat. It was super cold. Today it's warmer, but the wind's blowing like crazy. Let me know how your weather is. All right, we're going to head to Walgreens first and then we're going to jump into Rite Aid. If you enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. Woo! Happy Thursday. All right, we're in the Walgreens. I want to test out a possible glitch situation. Thank you to my friend Sandra, who sent me a message over on Instagram and showed me what she purchased and what she got. So we've got the deal of the week this week. It includes several products. It also includes these double packs of Crest baking soda and peroxide with the tag right there that they're $3 and they are buy three, earn back a $5 register reward. So I'm gonna pick these two up. We don't have any coupons for those. And then we've got this deal here on the double pack. They're $4 and they are on promotion or they're $4.99 and they're on promotion for buy two, earn back a $4 register reward. Now we have seen this happen sometimes where we have multiple um oral care deals and certain products are coded for both deals so i'm thinking the baking soda and peroxide is coded for the buy three get five and the buy two get four based on what sandra showed me so i'm testing it out today so i do need one more product for the buy three get the five dollar register reward so i'm going to go for one of the three dollar toothbrushes and i'm just gonna buy the exact same thing that sandra bought because i don't know if you know a medium and a soft are both gonna produce the two register rewards anyways this is what i'm getting so it's nine dollars for the three of these again i have no manufacturer coupons for these so i'll pay the nine dollars and then hopefully get back a five dollar register reward and a four dollar register reward now I'm just gonna go ahead and grab some cheap candy so that I can just use Walgreens cash to pay for the majority of this transaction and just convert my Walgreens cash into register rewards. I just wanted to test and see if this was actually working so that I could share it with you. This could be great for a spend deal if you have a digital booster that you haven't used yet. For me, I probably won't do this deal again because free oral care, we get free oral care pretty much whenever so every week so it's great if you need to rack up on some register rewards or if you have a spend deal to put this in so all right we're now gonna run over to Rite Aid and do an awesome deal at Rite Aid all right I am so excited about this deal at Rite Aid we have an awesome awesome P&G deal happening we have an in-ad coupon and we have a new rebate on the PG Good Every Day website for a $15 visa back. So this is gonna turn out to be a fantastic deal. So we've got Tide. Rite Aid is the only store I'm aware of that has a 20 count Tide Pods. They only had one in the original scent. I wanted to grab more, but I'm gonna grab this one. It's on sale for $6.94 this week. And these are on promotion for spend 30, earn back $10 in bonus cash. Along with the 46 ounce of the liquid tides, same sale, 694, 
spend 30, earn back $10 in bonus cash. This is a limit of two. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this deal two times. So since they didn't have more of the 20 count original Tide Pods, I'm gonna go ahead and grab three of the um, Tide liquids, the 46 ounce. And then also included is the Charmin and the Bounty, the Charmin big packs, the 12 equals of 48 rolls. This is the one my daughter prefers. The tag is over here, but it says the 12 equals, which this one is like a nine. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the red pack of Charmin, the 12 equals 48 rolls. It's on sale this week for $12.99. And I do have a digital coupon on the app for 25 cents off. And then for my Tide products, I'm gonna use one paper coupon from our April PNG for the Tide Pods and then three paper coupons for the liquid. Now, Rite Aid's coupon policy allows you to use four like coupons. Not every store may do that, but all of mine do. So I'm good with going ahead and using these four paper coupons. And then so I can do this deal twice. I'm only at 40.75 with my Charmin and my Tide. I'm gonna go ahead and add the Pampers which is also included. They are on sale for $10.99 each this week. So I'm gonna grab one size for EJ, and then I think I'm gonna grab one size for baby girl that's coming in September. So I'm gonna grab a size one of these, and I have a $3 digital coupon on the app for two packages of the Pampers. If you look in the app under weekly ad, Inside the ad, there is this awesome $10 off when you spend 60 in ad coupon from a Rite Aid, which is so awesome. So I definitely want to use that for this transaction to get an extra $10 in savings. Now, the only issue with using those in ad threshold coupons is if you use digital coupons, it counts against your spend amount. So I'm using the $3 digital coupon off the Pampers and the 25 cent digital coupon off the Charmin. So I actually need to make sure that my transaction total is 63.25 to be able to use both those digital coupons and the 10 off 60. The paper manufacturer coupons do not count against you at all. So right now I'm at 62.75, so I'm about 50 cents short of being able to use both digital coupons and that 10 off 60. So they've got the Russell Stover's um, candies on sale two for a dollar this week. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab two of those. That'll bring my total up to 63.75 and then all of my coupons will work together. So because I did this deal twice, I'll earn back $20 in bonus cash and then I'm going to be submitting to the PG Good Everyday website for a $15 visa back. The PG website, which I have linked down in the description box for you, runs these visa or MasterCard sometimes rebates and they go for three months now. They change the products that qualify every single time. So we haven't actually had tied I can't ever remember having Pampers since I've been doing these rebates, but we haven't had Tide in six months. But I did this rebate last quarter, already got my card. So now we start a new quarter. This runs from 327 to 630. And this rebate includes Tide, Bounty, Charmin, and Pampers. It also includes some other items. Go ahead and look at the rebate to know what it includes. And I already went to the rebate form, which you access right on their site, and typed in all the barcodes of the products I purchased to make sure they all qualified. So you can either do the spend 50, get a $15 Visa card, or the spend 20, get a $5 Visa card. And you have to spend that amount after manufacture coupons. So I'll go over this a little bit more with you at the debrief but we are gonna head to the kitchen table and go over my final cost. Oh my gosh, this deal at Rite Aid was so good with this rebate. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with my Thursday couponing haul. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this deal here. So I'll explain a little bit more about that, but first I went to Walgreens. I wanted to test out and see if this glitch worked for me 
because glitches can stop at any time. If it's glitch, it's not supposed to happen that way. And thank you to my friend, again, Sandra, who emailed me and let me know this was happening. And I definitely wanted to share it with you. So I grabbed the two value packs of Crest that are on the promotion of buy three, earn back a $5 register reward. And I was thinking based on what Sandra told me, they're also coded for the buy two, earn back the $4 register reward. So I grabbed those two and the Vivid Whitening. And then I grabbed some Almond Joys. I really wanted to grab some of the Russell Stover's that are on sale too for a dollar this week, but my store was totally out. So I grabbed the candy so that I could use, I didn't want to pay $4 out of pocket um, because my total would have only been nine something with tax and you can only use $5 in Walgreens cash or then it jumps up to 10. So that's why I added the candy. So there is my Almond Joys for 88 cents each. Both of my double packs of the Crest and the Oral-B. My subtotal was $10.76. I just went ahead and used $10 in Walgreens cash. I didn't earn any Walgreens cash back. The register spit me out a manufacturer coupon for $5. That is the buy three, earn back five. And it spit me out the register reward for $4. So it definitely is glitching and giving you back both of those deals. So do with that what you want to do with that and what you are comfortable. Again, like I said, in the store. It's a freebie. If you need oral care, great time to stock up. I don't, so I won't be doing it again just for a freebie, um, but great to add into a spend deal if you have a spend deal that you want to do as well and you're getting the double rewards back. So there was that. All right, then I moved over to Rite Aid. So excited. We got the 10 off 60. Now, I think I did a Rite Aid video last week We've got bonus cash challenges happening. Those vary per account. So not everybody will have the same bonus cash challenges. I had a tied bonus cash challenge, which I completed last week. Mine was for spend 36 in tied, and I earned back $9 in bonus cash. You may have a tied that spend a lower amount and earn a lower amount back. So definitely check that out. You can't do it more than once. Otherwise, this would have been a moneymaker. <laughs> but I'm also going to give you a couple of other scenarios. If you didn't, if you don't want to buy Pampers, I'm always looking for a good diaper deal. Um, you could get this even cheaper than what I got it. So let's take a look at my receipt. Remember, because I was using the two digital coupons, I had to spend the $63.25 for my 10 off 60 to work. So I got the two Pampers, there's my $3 digital load to card coupon. I got the Charmin, there's my 25 cent load to card coupon. And then I got the four Tides with all of my coupons scanning just fine. There's my 10 off 60 purchase. And then I got the two Russell Stovers. So my subtotal was 42.48. I used all the bonus cash I had, which was $15 in bonus cash. And I actually had more, but I forgot to like cash it out. See those points there? I can cash those out for bonus cash, but it does take 24 hours to hit your account. And I forgot to do it. Um, so I earned back $20 in bonus cash because I did these spend 30, earn 10 two times. Now, with the PNG rebate, I've done it at Walgreens for well over a year. They have never, ever counted using Walgreens cash against me. I've actually done it at Rite Aid as well. Never, ever count using bonus cash against me either. CVS used to be able to use extra bucks to pay and you'd still get your rebates, but I don't think that's working anymore. The one thing I'm not sure of with Rite Aid is I'm not sure if they will count this $10 coupon against me. It was a store coupon, not a manufacturer coupon. But to be safe, because you can submit up to five receipts, I purchased Pampers on Sunday at Walgreens. Those will count towards this rebate. So I'm going to submit my Rite Aid receipt and my um, Walgreens receipt, and that will get me over the spending 50 
It says right on, again, take a look at the website. It says right on there, I actually was gonna call them, but I was looking at the website today because you have to input the store you make the purchase at. And it says if you purchased at multiple stores, enter the most recent retailer and then submit up to five receipts. So you can definitely submit multiple receipts. Now, again, this rebate just started on 327. It runs all the way through 630. So you have plenty of time to do it and it is one per household. And again, with these P&G rebates, you have to look because they change the products every time. I had somebody message me last time um, that we had this rebate last quarter and she had purchased Pampers and Tide. Neither one of those were included in last quarter's rebate. I was like, those won't work. You can't submit them. So this time Tide is included Downey is not where it was included last time, but Pampers is also included. So if you are a mama or you are a grandmama and you have been getting diapers, I mean, we've only had this rebate for a little while. Again, you have plenty of time to do it. This is a great way to grab extra savings. So at my 4248, which was my subtotal for Rite Aid, I did use bonus cash to pay for part of that. My $20 that I spent over at Walgreens minus the $3 digital manufacturer coupon I use, I'm at over $50. So I'm going to earn back $15 in a Visa card, which is so awesome. So my cost for my writing transaction was the $42.48. I earned back $20 in bonus cash and the $15 Visa. It makes my cost $7.48. For four laundry products, two packages of diapers, and that huge thing of Charmin, that is fantastic. Now, if you wanted to do the deal where you didn't get any diapers, you could do it mix and match however you want if you want to do that PNG rebate. Um, you could grab seven laundry products if your Rite Aid will allow you to use the multiple of the PNG laundry coupons, and if you have them. Um, and one paper product after your coupons and your bonus cash back and the $15, it would cost you $2.32 for seven Tide laundry and one Charmin or Bounty. Or you could do five laundry and two paper products, mix and match however you want, after your coupons, the bonus cash coming back. And the $15 Visa, it would make your cost $5.18 for five laundry and two paper products. There's so many different ways that you can mix and match this. Oh my gosh, such a fantastic rebate. I'm so excited about this. I think I'm going to make my daughter sign up <laughs> so I can do it again because it is once per household. And I, you know, I purchased diapers for her. I purchased Tide for her. I purchased Charmin for her. So I think I'm just going to have her sign up so I can do that $15 rebate one more time. All right, that's what I got for you today. Such a fantastic deal over at Rite Aid if you enjoyed this video. And you can do this PNG rebate at any store you want to. It doesn't have to be at Rite Aid. It doesn't have to be at Walgreens. I would stay away from CVS. If I was you, unless you just want to not pay with extra bucks, but you can do the deal anywhere. All right. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.